What is up guys? So we are doing a 40% off sale in the apparel store. If you want to grab any of the Kilios stuff or the Spectre stuff, it's 40% off. Just use code on screen now and it's also going to be in the description below if you want to copy it as well as a link to the store. So if you want to grab something, grab it. If you don't, that's fine. But there's 40% off. So yeah. <laughs> Hello there! My name is Deadpool, and I stole $50 out of a blind woman's wallet and replaced it with a tissue. Who wants a drink? <laughs> well, mysterious stranger, what might your name be? You're getting nothing out of me, buddy. Is that Jewish? What? 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 Anyway, would you like a drink? This isn't a bar, mister. So you are Jewish? I what? Bar mister. Bar mitz. If any more of my jokes go over your head, you'll lose those last four strands of hair that stand between you and the dark abyss they call baldness. What the fuck? How do so you... what's your poison sugar? Let me guess. Heineken? With a thinly sliced lemon. A touch of salt. How do you... Who are you? Ding! Ding? Duh! What? This... Go on! Well, let's just say I know a little bit more about you than just your favorite drink. <laughs> what the fuck? It's not even cold! Okay, hold on. You drank it? What do you mean? I could be some twisted creep who wanted to drug you. Are you? No, but Damien, that's not the point. What the fuck? How do you know me? That's where you draw the line. You're, you're literally drinking out of a bottle I put outside your house. Oh my god, you really do need my help. What the fuck does that mean? You and I both know that you've got a problem, Matt Damien. <laughs> no, I don't. And my name is Dudley, Damien. Dudley, do you really want to stay at your friend's house for the rest of your life? Okay, who the fuck is this? This is an intervention. A what? An intervention. What the fuck is that? Oh my God, just take a sip and hold it out of your mouth. What? Just do it. Why? What the fuck is fuck? You fucking turn my lights off? I spat the fucking drink out! Exactly! I'm here by the request of your lovely wife, Clara, to scare you into spitting out the alcohol for good. It goes against everything I've ever said, but Daniela, it's time to stop swallowing. Firstly, that's not my fucking name. It's Damien. Secondly, you're trying to fucking tell me my wife asked some dumb motherfucker to give me some kind of intervention? Correct. Fucking bullshit! I'm calling her right goddamn now! Oh, I don't think that's a good idea. Shut up! I'm calling! I wouldn't do that if I were you. Shut the fuck! I'm calling my wife! No, no you're not. You're not. What? What the fuck? How the fuck do you have my wife's phone, you asshole? I don't have your wife's phone, you angry little beer grip. What the fuck is going on But from here? now on, it will be diverting to me anytime you try to call her. You... So, if you want to see your wife and daughter again, you're going to listen to every little word that slides out of these secret little sex lips of mine. Understood? Uh, ah. Yeah. Welcome to rock bottom, Daphne. I mean, your wife and daughter it, kicked you out. You somehow me. sound like you haven't showered in four days. You're staying at your musty friend Gary's place, and for the love of God, you're about to be guided back to sobriety by a guy who sounds like Deadpool over a video game. Your bottom has officially been rocked. Okay, listen, motherfucker. I can give you the big tip. Ooh, please do. See, this fucking intervention bullshit is not happening. I'm not taking advice from a fucking idiot like you. You don't even fucking know me, okay? I'm already fixing shit with my wife and kids. Uh, yeah? You and how's that going for you? No, I didn't! Can you shut the fuck up, please? Oh! I... Actually, I think that was 
Seriously, you don't want to turn out like Gary, do you? He's like a walking contraceptive, but instead of killing sperm, he just makes everybody around him want to kill themselves. I mean, his depression probably has depression. And trust me, I know a little more than you think, District 9 Director Scott. My name is Damien, you stupid fucking asshole! Damien! And no, you don't fucking know shit about me! I know you have a cute little teardrop tattoo on your left butt cheek. What the fuck? No, I, I know don't... you're a folder, not a scruncher. How do you- I know your first kiss was your cousin Amy. Yikes! Hey! Hey! Okay. I know you can't sleep without a nightlight on. Okay! Ooh, I know on one of your first dates with your wife- I said You okay. accidentally- Well, let's just say that you should have worn brown pants. You fucking know some shit about me, but th that doesn't mean you can butt the fuck into my life. I will drink if I want to. I will butt and fuck as I please! And from today, sir, you're not drinking one more drop of alcohol. Yeah, I fucking am! When the fuck did you give me this beer, that dumbass? Yeah, well the thing about that beer is that it's uh, non-alcoholic. What? It also has a no, few little extra nutrients in it, like formulated goat's milk that went bad about two years ago, fish liver oil, burnt hairs from an unknown location on my body, and will finally- A fucking a USB? What the fuck is wrong with you? Look, we're already off to a great start. You now have a bad memory connected to alcohol. You're welcome. Fuck you. Now, Dame Adna, I'm going to need you to plug that USB into your computer and watch the video to begin our journey to sobriety. No, I'm not fucking doing this. Daddy? You. Where are you coming home? Where are you? This is one way to encourage you to do as I say. The other way is a lot less nice and a lot more fun for me. So how about you go ahead and turn on your computer and plug the USB into it before I plug something into you and turn me on. Good boy. What is up guys? So this video is sponsored by Enlisted. Now hear me out because without sponsors, well, my videos would be a little different. Let me give you a taste of what things could look like. Okay, ad promo time, huh? Enlisted is a World War II multiplayer shooter that's focused that's on focused historical on authenticity place. while keeping Ooh, gameplay dynamic and saucy. So you're always in the middle of the action. Oh yeah, I like being in the middle of the action. Enlisted is available on PC, Xbox Series X and S, as well as PlayStation 5 and previous console generations, and they have cross-platform support. The game is free, just follow the link in the description to download and play it. So yeah, sponsors are pretty important, okay? Now, there's a few reasons I actually like Enlisted and you might as well. For example, the vehicles they have in the game make the fights more immersive and it's not just standard boots on the ground like a lot of other shooters are, which I think is unique. You can join the battles as a ground vehicle crew or aircraft pilot with heaps of cars, tanks, fighters, bombers, and other vehicles to choose from and they're always adding more stuff to you. And one of the coolest things is the construction side because I feel like in a lot of shooters you just you don't have that ability to change the actual layout of the game and I think that that's sick. So in Enlisted, you can construct buildings in battle as an engineer including sandbag fortifications, stationary machine guns, anti-tank cannons, anti-air guns, and more. So please check it out because they're supporting me and it's actually a solid game. Just register using my link. It's free and it's available on PC, PlayStation, and Xbox. You'll also get three days of premium time and several orders for troops and weapons as a little bonus. Anyway, back to the- Mmm. Welcome, child, to your very own three-step recovery program. But don't think of it as that. Think of it as the journey to meeting your best self. My name is Felicity, and I will be your spiritual guide slash astral sex fantasy for this evening. You're about to embark on a journey of reflection, healing, and of course, self-discovery. And I am all about self-discovery. But this is the kind that if you do it in front of others, you won't get in trouble. So we must first look inside, Damien, from behind. You see Deadpool, who I have never met or share any similarities with, is going to list some things you have done in your past. These things will hurt you, but you must recognize the wound. 
please pause this video now, Damien. Over to you, my red rubbery sex demon. God, there is just something about that felicity, isn't there? Are you fucking serious? Now, Deepak Chopra, this one is simple. I have a list of some bad things you've done, and I'm going to read them out, and you're going to listen and really take them in. Got it? Fine. Okay. <clears throat> You got drunk and fell over little Stephanie's art project and broke it. You then put it in the bin because you thought it was actually trash. That is awful. I didn't know. No, you don't get to talk. But it wasn't like Hush that. Hush now, Kimosabe. You- Zip it. You got angry with the toaster because it burnt your bread. So like any sane person, you decide to throw it across the room and where did it land? It, it Rhetorical landed. question. It landed on another one of Stephanie's art projects. I mean, you can't make this stuff up. You also picked up a hitchhiker after again getting drunk. You brought them home and they stayed for dinner and they stole your TV? You, okay, you need to explain this to me. I, well, they wanted, Rhetorical! You, you punched a friend stop. of your wife's after she said that she hated a TV show you loved. You backed your car over Steffi's art project. I'm just kidding. Could you imagine though? That would be awful. No, it was just her turtle. Oh my God, you killed her turtle. That, that was an accident. How about missing your daughter's dance recital? You vomited on the pitch of her soccer game. You fought one of her teachers. You kicked over your own barbecue because your wife didn't get you another drink. Okay, you selfishly enough. bought a motorcycle, putting your family in deeper debt. Okay. You shat in a picnic basket by accident. What? Okay. You, Damien, have embarrassed your wife, your child, and yourself at every turn of your life for the last 12 months. Okay. And there's one more thing you need to face today that I don't think you I know. Of. I'm. No, Brony. What? What the fuck are you talking about? How many seasons? I don't know what you're talking about. How many seasons? I, I don't know. You own a box set, Damien. All of the seasons. No, I, I barely even watch. You bought that box set of My Little Pony at a convention, didn't you? The convention you were going to was Steffi, but she got sick. But guess who still went? And that's not all you bought there, was it? Was it? Man, I don't know what you're fucking talking about. You bought a limited edition Pinkie Pie Glow in the Dark Night Sparkle t-shirt with the ultra rare cherry berry glitter keychain fucking... included. It was for Steph Steffi is not a men's medium. Okay. Now, I think we've made all your issues quite clear. So I believe it's time to move to step two. Please refer back to Felicity to continue your brony. What? Your journey. Well... What a beautifully third eye opening experience that was for you, Damien. Now we need to take the next necessary steps across the bridge of forgiveness to reach the fantabulous land of who you want to be. And so, you and your newfound friend Deadpool here are going to make a call to whom? What? That's right, we're gonna make a call to your mother-in-law. Now, why might we be sake. calling June today? Because you... I... I was trying to lift up a box, but it was too heavy, so she said I was a weak, malnourished lesbian and, and kept calling me Ellen Degenerate, so I pushed her down some stairs. That's right, Mrs. Degenerate, and I think it's time we make amends. So you're going to call her on the loudspeaker and repeat exactly what I tell you to, got it? Your fucking funeral. Hello, Damien. Hello, my favorite mother-in-law. I'm calling because I want to apologize Hello. for pushing you down those oh, stairs. Sake. Hello, my favorite mother. I'm calling because I want to apologize for pushing you down the stairs. You're calling me to apologize? <laughs> yes, I believe you are the most important woman in my life. You are the creator of my wife, who is my heart. You literally created my Jesus love. Jesus Christ. Yes, I believe you are the most important woman in my life. You are the creator of are my- you drinking again? Creator of my wife, who is creator my Creator of my wife, you literally who created my is love. my heart. You literally created my love. Fucking charity case and always will be. 
A fucking make-a-wish kid. And the only difference between you and them is you're annoyingly not fucking dying. Oh my god. I told you. Okay, okay. Say, I believe your hate for me is all from your love of your daughter. I believe your hate for me is all from your love of your daughter. Oh, really? No fucking shit, Sherlock. June, I cannot fault you for wanting the best for your little girl. June, I cannot fault you for wanting the best for your little girl. And I know I'm not there yet. And I know I'm not there yet. Sunshine, you're not even fucking close. But I promise I am working to be the husband you always wanted for her. I promise I'm working to be the husband you always wanted for her. Oh, that's just gorgeous. And how are you gonna do that? I'm going to shoot this. You're right. Oh boy. I'm not even close to what Claire deserves. But when we're together, she reminds me of how great I can be. And I'm not changing to prove you wrong. I'm changing to prove her right. I'm going to prove everything she believed me to be. I can and will be. Because she deserves that. Do you want to know what I'm going to do? I'm giving up drinking. Because I will not give up Clara like you want me to. I love her with everything that I am. Oh my god! My drunken little caterpillar turned into a beautiful Thank little you. butterfly. You can go and shove your little motivational speech right up your fucking ass. I hung up. Oh. Oh my. Wow. Yeah, that is that is not how I imagined that going. Well, I, uh, on to your next step, I guess. Well, hello again. It's time once more to suckle at the bosom of destiny, Damien. Your final step in your path to recovery is this. Expand your horizons. You must direct your pain to a new outlet. Today you will be entering the creative realm and will be drawing out your emotions. You have been gifted with utensils and provided with inspiration. It is now time to create, my sweet child. Go forth and create. 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 What? I'm drawing? That's right. And luckily for you, I have handpicked a perfect subject to draw. So how about you go, Vincent Van, go check your no, front door? No, I'm sorry. I'm not fucking drawing. This has nothing to do <clears throat> with. <clears throat> what the fuck? <clears throat> Gary? Gary, what the fuck? He, he told me to. I, who told you to? This fucking guy? Thanks, Gary Bear! Yeah, you'd be surprised what your friend Gary would do for $15. And what he won't do for $20. i am still not fucking doing this. I'm not drawing a fucking... I don't like my little fucking My body. little pony. What the my, fuck? You better sing it. Stop. My little pony. Stop. Sing. Fuck. My little pony. I used to wonder, I, what, friendship I wonder what friendship could be. Until you I, shared its until magic you shared with me. Until magic with me. What the it's this fucking guy. He made me do it. Sorry, Gary. All right, let's stop horsing around. It's time to draw. I'm not. Uh, uh, uh. You know you have no choice here, sugar tits. I have a question. What? Which pony do you think I'd be? Are you fucking I feel like I'm more me? of a pinkie pie spreading hope and joy. But maybe I'm afraid to admit that I'm really just a spike. An adopted baby dragon that doesn't fully belong in a world of cute ponies. Can you, know? you shut the fuck up? Hey, have you ever drank so much alcohol that you farted out beer? What? That's physically imp impressive. Yeah, that's true. No, I was going to say imp impartial. Imp Imposter? Insufferable! In impotent! Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Impossible! I was going to say impossible! Haha! <laughs> I know! Ugh. Okay. Okay? Yes, it's fucking done. Oh my goodness! Okay, well all you have to do now is drop that sucker outside, and then listen to the final message of your three-step program. I, I thought I was keeping it. Oh, you- so you- you want to keep the drawing of the pony? Yes. For my daughter. For your daughter, yes, okay. Fuck you. Oh my. I barely recognize you, Damien. 
I mean, look at you. I am so proud of how far we both came together. Came together. You have now completed your three steps, and your wife Clara has agreed she would be happy to give you another chance. Another chance. Another chance. Now I have left a final present for you. To aid you on your continuing journey of self-improvement, it's on your doorstep. Goodbye and farewell, my effervescent, effervescent John. John. So that's it. I did all that, and now my wife isn't going to take custody of my daughter, and she's going to give me another Didn't chance. you hear the lady? I don't write the rules here, buddy. <laughs> what? Just, <laughs> it's fucking weird. Well, I mean, there is something you should know. What? I never really had the power to actually cut you off from your wife and kid. What? Yeah, everything you did was kind of irrelevant, because they already forgave you, but they wanted to know for sure. See, I'm kind of like the morning after pill. I may do a lot of damage, but I'm there just to make sure. Are you mad? So can I go now? You sure can! All you need to do is go and grab your present, and we'll put your past behind you. What is this? Open it and find out. A tape recorder? That's right! A lot of recovering alcoholics have a little audio recording they listen to every day. So I thought, well, Felicity thought, it would be useful for you. I... okay... Well, aren't you curious to know what's on it? Fine. My little pony! My little pony. God, so fucking it's magic. Once again, thanks to our sponsor, Enlisted. Make sure to check it out. It's free to play on PlayStation, Xbox, and PC, and you'll get three days premium time and several orders for troops and weapons when you use my link in the description. Thank you and goodbye. You mad, bro? Uh, yeah. I said, tell me what you mad for. Uh, you mad, bro?